In August, we all rode our bikes around the apartment complex despite the overwhelming heat and humidity. When the downpour came, right on time each day, we coasted along roads with soaking clothes and big smiles. Once in the evening, I found a dog hiding underneath a boat trailer out by the pond. After Pop finally gave up his protestations, Molly became a primary part of my life, along with biking in the, in the August Florida rain. Another time, I saw a girl I knew from the apartment complex at the roller rink. She used to ride with us, then her parents moved to a different complex. I didn't have the courage to talk to her that day or skate with her, God forbid. But I still remember the first vision and sensation I ever had of what falling in love would feel like. That girl was on the back of my, my bike with her arms wrapped around me. I have not seen her or heard of her since, but she was the first girl I ever really fell in love with. I remember what that, that vision felt like. I was complete and confident and, and lovesick, but the sweetest kind of lovesick there ever could be. Instead of spending time with girls who had more balls than me, I spent most of my time with Molly and other dogs. Often, I feel I can fundamentally relate to seeing the world without depth and with no colors. It's, it's easier that way for days to coast along, doomless, hopeful, as they are for child bikers in the August Florida rain.